Hello everybody, welcome to another series of uh, clarinet tool review. Today we are going to review a Vandurin V12 rib trimmer. As you can see, just like that, so you're able to trim your rib for longer life. This one costs $141 out of Amazon and $156 after tax and shipping. So this is what it looks like, it comes with this package. item itself is this so you guys can see it let's go right in here but yeah all right so basically you're able to trim your reed for longer life whenever the reed gets soft again these are in each model they're separate uh, reed trimmer this one is specifically for v12 this is what i use all the time so i don't have to throw away after a couple of um use because usually me on average about three weeks that i use it every other day the root the reeds uh gets really soft and i have to throw it away but this one will save me uh, a lot of money in the long run especially for my daughter since um she's starting to learn clarinet and i want her to have a really good read all the time so this is the item looks like so this uh, there are two adjustments the bottom one is to raise the reed up high and low and this one is for left and right so, so this is just an example okay this is a Ligier European cut reed so you put it in there just like that and then you can adjust this knob to raise it up to the cutter right here so when you make a full 360 turn it will cut I know it's focusing on me right there that's the cutter it looks like a nail cutter at the very end tip so this one is to raise the reed up and down this knob is for left and right and then 360 degrees turn will cut the reed We'll trim the reed actually yeah cut trim this in so we'll give it a try so i have a v12 this is a v12 3 and i've used this maybe maybe six seven times and it gets really soft it's still not still not bad but for me it is soft it's hard to articulate and hard to play in a higher pitch altissimo so we'll give it a try For me, it's hard to articulate. It's still not bad, but for me, it's already soft. So, we'll give it a try, okay? So again, so let me move out of the frame. So you put the reed over here, make sure it's in the center of the cutter, right there. And there are notches. Let me go this way. I can see it. So there are notches right here, you see? And there is a pointed arrow right here. So you can cut this reed 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 times. 10 times. So each notch is about a millimeter um, thickness. Okay, so right now it's in zero. So you put it in the first notch right here. Yeah, so it, it raises the reed up in the cutter. And this one, there's a notch in the center. Make sure it's centered. The pointing tip is in the center. And then you make a 360 degrees turn. You hear that? So, 
So it's the back, it should fall off, but I didn't see anything. But I felt it. So this is only the first one. Uh oh, see, that's what happened if you don't center it properly. You cut on the side. Let's try again. Okay, second notch. Okay, much better. So now let's give it a try. much better and it feels more responsive Okay, so that is the Vanderin V12 reed trimmer. It's expensive, but in the long run, it'll pay off for itself. So you can cut a reed. We can trim a reed 10 times. So it'll make uh, the lifespan of the reed 10 times. Okay, this is the product. It's really easy to use. Only has three knobs, up and down, left to right, and the cutter itself. Okay, hopefully you guys learn something and uh, share this in case it might be expensive but it's worth the investment. So, all different uh, cuts. Alright, see you!